hello everybody it's me Tia and I am back with another video now I know I know somebody gonna say girl where the hell you been I know I was supposed to be back like mm, six years ago but life happened girl and I mean I'm here today I mean you know I'm here today so um I figured what I do is to start or okay scratch that what I thought I do is start where I originally started when I first started my YouTube channel 10 11 12 years ago and that video that I did was a what's in your purse video so I figured let's restart with the same type of video plus i can sit and watch these type of videos all day i don't know if it's just because i'm nosy or because i like to get ideas of what other people carry in their purse that i need to be carrying in mine that i don't carry already or i'm like addicted to little like accessories little small leather goods little pouches and things i don't i don't know and of course i'm addicted to purses so I figure what I try to do is do these at least once a month because I can't promise that I'm going to be back on a regular regular like a regular smegular but I can do at least once a month so let's get started with the video okay so this sucker is packed right now because I was shopping today and I was running errands so it has a little bit more than usual so also while I am doing a what's in my bag video I figure I clean it out as well so that's what we're gonna be doing today also if you hear noise in the background I now am the mother of a six-year-old yes when you saw me last I had no kids I have a six-year-old now so he um, is my date for the night because Anthony is out and about and I'm in the house on my mamiana duties, which is okay. I mean, it's cool. Ain't nothing in these streets for me right now. But when I do want to get out, I get out. So, anywho, let's get on with the video. So, um, this is the bag that I'm carrying now. This is, oh my God, I should have had this prepared and ready. I don't know if I have the tag around somewhere to just... I'm sorry, y'all. I don't know what the name of this bag is, but it's not like the regular tote, which I'm probably going to do a video on that one eventually because I have that one too. But this is like a more of a north-south one. As you can see, like this side is kind of pinched. This side. I don't know what this is called. I will find the name and put it in the drop down below. I have a girl that works at MTM who sends me pictures when they have sales and stuff so i have i don't want to say a huge mcm's collection because i don't but i have a few mcm pieces so and most of them i get from my um mcm sales lady so here's what's in the bag i'll just give you an overview girl Ugh. sorry that's just what it is first thing like i said i was at the mall today these are my back to mac empties because or just stuff that i don't want anymore because i knew i wanted to go check out the new um the new new collection whatever that's called oh my god here he comes okay next thing in here is my keys and i have this like leather flower leather puff ball i don't know what this is supposed to be but it's either a, it's supposed to be like a leather puff ball or leather flower or leather rose i don't know it's from michael kors but i just have my keys on there um mcdonald receipt some spearmint supplements because i'm breaking out and I don't like it because I don't like to wear makeup every day. But um, I am in this skincare group on Facebook. And someone rep recommended a spearmint leaf tablet or tea to kind of help with the um, breakout. So that's what that is. I have this little sanitizer. It looks like a little duck. I got this from uh, Target. 
my favorite lip balm in a stick form is this hemp's lip balm and this is in whipped strawberry and cream i love i love this stuff this is so good y'all like i love the consistent the consistency and the smell the smell is very um authentic if you know what i mean because you have gotten those uh, chapsticks where the strawberry it smells like mm, I don't know I I don't know it, it doesn't smell like a strawberry but this smells like strawberry and cream like it's good oh some um gimme brows and 4.5 I got this during the 21 days of beauty at Ulta why is all this just floating around? I should have a makeup bag somewhere in here. But again, um, this is my Fenty blotting papers. This is my wet pouch. And I just kind of keep um, like these Kleenex singles in here. Um, shout to go wipes. Acne dots. Um, deodorant wipes. And I had some of those uh, Neutrogena uh, individual wrapped makeup toilets in there, but I must have used them all, girl. I have my planner, which I got this six ring binder off of Amazon. And then the inserts I bought from Michaels and, and the little accessories. So that's that. My change purse, which is... Henry Bindle. I'm so sad that they have decided to sh shut down shop because Henry Bindle is one of my favorite places to go for purse accessories, like little things to go in your purse. I love, love Henry Bindle, but this was a coin purse. And this, ca this came in one of those three piece sets. I bought the whole set simply for this change purse. Another Henry Bindle piece. This is um, actually an eyeglass case holder. I bought it because I wanted to use it for pens. You know when you have a nice bag, you don't want pens just floating around in case they mess up, you know, burst or mess up your stuff. So I wanted something like this because I know if it does happen, it won't mess up my purse. I have these shades, which, yes, should be inside of an eyeglass case, but they're not. I love these glasses. Like, I feel so, mm -mm -mm. I feel like, I don't know. Or, you know, you could do either one. I don't know. But I love these glasses. I got these from Aldo. And that should be in the case, but they're not. So me. I have some hand food. I'm sorry if these lights are kind of throwing stuff off guys. I have a draft pen. You get this in the baby section at Target, sorry, in the baby section at Target, girl, get you one of these. Let me tell you, this to me is better than a Tide pen. Look at the scrubbers on the tip. Let me tell you, my baby had a bloody nose the other day, and he it bled all over the sheets. I scrubbed that thing, scrubbed it down with this, washed it. You never know it was there. Never know that. Imagine if you was out with your girls and you wasted some wine or some barbecue sauce or some chicken grease or something on your shirt. You need to get it out right away. You got one of these in your purse. Girl, get you one. Get you one or two. Get you a few of them. Leave one by the bedside, one in the car, one in the desk at work. Girl, get you a couple of them. You need it in your life. Let's see. I have this mini pochette in here, which I use as a catch-all. Um, I use this thing for everything. Hell, it costs enough. I'm going to use it for as many things as I can. But for right now, I'm using it as a catch-all. Sometimes I attach that and use it as a little purse when I go out to the club or whatever. But in here, I have this. It looks like a pencil, but it has different little tips on there, like screwdriver, flathead, and all that kind of stuff. Um, this is a little knife. Uh, my per favorite perfume right now, which is Ari Ariana Grande Cloud. Um, another Kleenex wipe. My car starter, um, a little multi thing for your nails and stuff. Just a whole like a whole bunch of little stuff. A little mini bite thing. Um, my clipper purse hanger, little bottle of clear nail polish. Um, when my hair was down, I used these clips. Just, just you know, a little random. 
random stuff like that I keep in here. I'm gonna put that back before I lose something. Okay, keep it moving. I have this tea. I bought a um, box of assorted teas, and this is the pack that has the country peach passion in there. And I believe it's like four packs um, or three bags of tea in here. So got that just in case I'm somewhere and I need some water or I got some hot water and I want some tea instead. Um, this Laneige, 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 Laneige lip balm. Um, this is actually a lip sleeping mask. I use it for lip balm all throughout the day just because I love the way it feels. It smells like candy. Um, this is the best jar. This is my favorite jar lip balm. So I always have one of these in my purse. Or both of them in my purse. Just depends which one I reach for. Um, I have some MAC lip gloss in Spite. Which I believe is what I have on now. I have this Dose of Colors Mickey Mouse lipstick in 1940. 1928. The peachy one. Um, debit card should be somewhere else. Marc Jacobs lip gloss stick. And this is in the color Mocha Chocolata. This, for me, is like a perfect uh, brown girl nude. Like, it's it's an essential for me. I love it. I usually keep it in my purse. Only thing I don't like about this is, one, the clicks. You always hear it when you're turning it. And also, once it goes up, it doesn't go down. So, you don't know how much you have in there. But I love that lip gloss. I just got this one recently, also within the 21 Days of Beauty. This is my... Um, one of my favorite lip gloss formulas too. This is Lavender Cosmo by Buxom. That's my favorite color. That one in Blush and Margarita. Um, my blood pressure pills, I just got it in this little case that I got whoop, from Amazon. A peppermint. This is the Sarah Hap the slip lip gloss i like this because it's thick and it feels like a lip mask like i love lip masks because they're thick i love thick sticky type lip glosses again another thick sticky one which is an oh listen here if you know about sweet talk lip gloss from victoria's secret then you know some because this thing used to be the bomb back in the day and i'm so mad they discontinued them but hey it is what it is everything good can't last forever this is my kate spade card holder Um, a little travel size, I'm trying to, sorry y'all, deodorant, dove, some gum, this is Orbit, Alter Receipts, more Alter Receipts, um, this is Cream Lipstick by Bite Beauty. I'm sure I bought this from like TJ Maxx or Target or somewhere. I mean, TJ Maxx or Marshalls. Uh, my Bluetooth headphones. I don't have any Beats or AirPods. Still rocking with that. I have this NARS lip balm. It's okay. Like, I'm not a fan. I keep it because it's, I like the packaging. But if my least, niece comes around, she'll probably end up with it. A plug for my charger. My son goes crazy over this stuff, so I make sure to keep some in my purse. And I just bought a big jar of it. Um, um, the sorry for the lights. This is Chick Fil A. Chick Fil A sauce. <laughs> he loves this stuff. He'll eat whatever as long as I give him that to dip it in. He'll eat broccoli if I let him dip it in that. I have this Mac bag because I I went to Mac today. I had to get my birth certificate because I'm getting ready to go on a cruise and I need my passport. Oh, this is a little letter from my boo. He wrote, will you go with me? Yes, no, maybe. He wrote me this little cute note when I was mad at him. So I just keep it in my purse sometimes to remind me that he can be sweet sometimes. This is a mirror that I got from Amazon and it's um, lights up. So if you're out at night in the club or something want to be extra i don't know or just want to see yourself you can light this up i don't know if i have it charged right now 
Yeah, it's not charged, but when it is, um, you it has three different settings, so it'll be dim, brighter, brighter, and then you know you turn it off. But this button does work, and these lights come on when it's charged. I have two brushes that I picked up from Ulta today, which need to come out of my purse. This is the M536, because um, I like to use a jelly primer and then set it with powder, and I thought this would be good to do that. And then, I mean, to, you know, to set my primer. And then I got this one, um, which is the Chubby Buffer Brush, and I got this to just kind of blend out eyeshadow primer. Put that over there, because it needs to go up. Um, this is the lip gloss I got today from MAC. It's from the new collection, which is... This is one of the ones I backed to MAC for. Um, what is it called? I forget, but you know the new collection. And this gloss I got is Fashion something. They drew the X over it, so I can't tell what it is. But I think it's Fashion Punch. Something like that. This is a real pretty um, new color. Oh my God, I can't believe this video was so long, girl. I'm sorry. Sorry, I'm sorry. Don't mind me. This is my favorite new lipstick right now. This is MAC Full Bread Brown. Full Bread Brown. And it's this. It looks really, really good on the lips. A lot lighter than it looks on my hand, actually. I have these Listerine tabs where it's mouthwash. You just chew them, swish them around, and then it feels like you just did mouthwash. Yes, Aiden. Okay, hold on. I'm coming. You need to snack. I got this Marc Jacobs Concealer. This is new. Um, I got this today at Sephora. This is in Deep 50. And this is one of those new Touch Up and Go Concealers. Um, that's it right there. I hope it's not too light because what I got it for is like to conceal in my blemishes. And then I could just, you know, put over, put powder over it on a go. But that's it blended out. So it might be okay. Then I have this sample of the Milk Hydra Grip Primer. I have a portable battery charger, cork lip liner, a Kroger coupon, more lip gloss, a uh, Gin Fizz, Buxom. Oh, there it is. One of my Pandora bracelets. I guess I didn't feel like putting it on one day or something. I don't know. This travel size of Rihanna's setting powder. And this is in the color Nutmeg. I love this stuff up, even all over. And this is a little pouch that comes with it. It's a little different than the other pouch because this one is just plain on the back. But the front is the same. And you can hook this, of course, and do like the little thing. But in this so this pouch looks like this. Um, and on the inside, I basically when I carry this bag, I use this as a wallet and then along with my card case. So it has little slits in here, which I put some of my cards in. And then if I have any cash, I put it in there. And also this holds my coupons and then other credit cards or whatever that I don't use on a regular basis. So, whew. Girl, that is all that is in my bag. I will show you what the bag looks like um, on the inside. This is it empty. And see, from here, you can kind of see what I was talking about as far as one side being pinched and the other side having, or is it this side? One side has two. I thought it did. It's like this, and then the other side is like pinched. I don't know. I'll figure out the name of this if anybody's interested and put it down below. Thank you all for standing with me and watching this long video. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. But hopefully the next one gets shorter and I get more accustomed to being in front of the camera again. So thank you all for bearing with me. Thank you for watching and have a great weekend. Mwah. Bye.